I'm Kipley Brown. And I'm Jen Kane. Here's our top story. Friday's Olympic opening ceremonies featured a sequence where Queen Elizabeth and James Bond appeared to parachute into the stadium. It was the first time a British royal had gone down in public since the night before when Prince Harry visited Britain's women's volleyball team. <laughs> Mitt Romney! Uh, <laughs> Mitt Romney caused controversy during his trip to the United Kingdom by criticizing London's preparedness for the Olympics. And if anybody in the world knows what it's like to be unprepared for a big event, it's Mitt Romney. <laughs> A Greek athlete was banished from the Olympics Wednesday for tweeting racist remarks. So add racism to the list of things that Greece cannot afford. <laughs> the U.S. is mourning the loss of the first American woman in space after astronaut Sally Ride passed away Monday at the age of 61. Commented Ralph Cramden. Uh, I think you forget first American woman in space. You're forgetting about my wife, Alice. Faye, Sue, to the moon, Alice! <laughs> North Korean dictator Kim Jong-un has gotten married. The couple is registered at Bed Bath & Beyond Famished. <laughs> missing, Michael Jackson's mother was found safe with family members in Arizona, said Tito Jackson. Now that my mother's safe, we can focus on what's harder for Jacksons to find, jobs. <laughs> <laughs> signing up for a chance to win a night with Goslin, her children. <laughs> Just for the record, I'd like to point out that Frazier has won more Emmys than any other television situation comedy in history. He won 37. I just, you know. So I have been recognized before. In upstate New York, a man fell into a 40-foot gorge trying to sneak into a nickelback. <laughs> I'm sorry, let me rephrase that. In upstate New York, a man was rescued from a Nickelback concert by a benevolent gorge. Do you know I'm the only person to be nominated for playing the same character in three different shows, in Cheers and Wings and Frasier? That's quite an accomplishment, a fourth show for President Um as, pun as punishment for destroying a photographer's cell phone, Russell Brand has been ordered to perform community service. Brand has the option to pick up trash or just tie himself up in a bag. <laughs> um, you know, my character is dying of a disease on my show. That's, that's very difficult to play. It's very dramatic, much easier than being an ad man in the 1960s. <laughs> um, and finally, the... Uh, President of NBC, my own network. Um, the president of NBC says that by adding more comedies to their schedule, the network hopes to broaden its audience. It's all part of their plan to reach the covered in anybody demographic. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted an Emmy! <laughs> Damn you! Wednesday after being abducted the previous day. 
Unfortunately, the incident ended her 27,586 day not being abducted. <laughs> sweeteners and no funny aftertaste, said a spokesman for Coke. We're going to call this new drink water. <laughs> <laughs> Indonesian zookeepers have sequestered an orangutan named Tori so she can quit smoking uh, cigarettes that visitors put in her cage. So good luck to Tori in getting that monkey off her back. <laughs> May we say it's not easy. How many, how long has it been now, Jen? Four months. Woo, Jen! <laughs> now, monkey out of your back. New research indicates that shark teeth contain fluoride, the main ingredient in toothpaste. Of course, the study excluded British sharks. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> Tuesday was National Tequila Day. And Wednesday was National Oh God, What the Hell Did I Do Yesterday Day. <laughs> According to The Hollywood Reporter, USC is the nation's top film school. And film school is the nation's top waste of money. 